Hey everybody, Paperclip here again. We're going to be playing some more Planet Base. This is episode 7, I believe now. Yeah, yeah, episode 7. So, and this time we are taking it a little more conservatively. We have three level 3 power collectors. Not a ton of power generation, because if we can't fill the collectors with all the power we generate, it's kind of pointless to have all this power generation anyway. If these all go all the way down, it won't be good. So I think I should actually get some medium. It's the same size it appears. Build another one of them. That way, I have a constant 60 power generation, minimum, even with no wind at all. So I want to stay on top of everything. I'd rather never have a problem. I'd rather constantly solve all potential future problems before they actually become live active. Like, you see right now, it's during the day, and I was just running a deficit on power. Don't want that to be happening. I want to always run a surplus on power during the day, no matter what. Having this extra solar power, it's not going to actually help me today, but I'm already sitting on about 18,000, I guess we'll call it kilowatts of power. I guess that's what we'll call it. Units of power, however, this game measures it. And what kind of colonists do we get this time? We got a biologist. Cool. So now we have four biologists, six workers, and three engineers. So now that we have more biologists, I think it's time to slightly expand this. And by slightly, I really do mean slightly. So we're going to go ahead and get one medicinal pad. And that's it. Slightly. I think I have enough to actually make more than one medicinal pad, but I'm just going to ride that and see what happens. Because I'm not on a shortage of food. I mean, hell. Look at my... S I have 40 vegetables. 40 freaking vegetables and that's not I don't believe that's even including the vegetables that I have inside the meal makers see why is this one have five meals and a thing of vegetables well this one has four meals and two things of vegetables I don't get what what the line is that they cross before they decide they don't need to make meals anymore but anyway oop, here's a trade ship what do you have for me, trade and trade? A gun. Spares. Driller bot patent. Carrier bot. Constructor bot. I do want your carrier bot. I wish I could right click and do like all or something like that. And I will give you a bunch of vegetables to try and cover up the rest. There we go. 13 vegetables, 47. You give me another carrier bot. I'm willing to accept that. Because then I still have an alright, I still have a decent surplus of vegetables. I still have like 25. So I'll be sitting on 25 vegetables and about 10 meals. That won't be too bad. I've still never built this cabin. I'm very interested to see what this cabin actually looks like. Alright, sweet. So that's another carrier bot. So that'll help us shuffle resources around quite a bit. Free up some of our workers to actually do things like mine and process goods instead of carrying goods from place to place. Alright. So how we do on power last night? 
We have more power now than we did at the end of the night. Wow. Yeah, we're gonna be fine on power for a little bit. The extra solar power generator was just a precautionary measure. I didn't really feel like I needed it, but it's always better to have than to want. Alright, so I think it's about time to go ahead and... Uh, build a water tower. Build a big one. Yeah, I can't build a big one right there. What did we get? What are green guys? I forget. Come on, stop walking away from me. Biologist. Ooh, so what do I have? Six biologists now? I have six biologists now. So we're definitely good. Say, hey, why don't you grow me some onions and some potatoes? Since I have all those, I think I'm going to say, I really don't need more biologists right now. I could still use another engineer. Another medic wouldn't be bad. And more workers. Yeah, so... Go ahead and do that, because I really need more workers. I could use another medic. And I could use another engineer. Go ahead back up to speed four. So how are we on metal? Maybe it's about time I build a lab. Trading ship, so slow down. What do you have? Nothing that I really want. So, what if I just give you 15 vegetables, a couple bioplastic, and you give me all of your money for that? Ooh, you will. And I could even take a vegetable away, and you'd be fine with it. Yeah, that'd be fun. Let's go ahead and do that. Because I have the money in case something really good comes along, I can just throw the money at him. Just in case I don't have the extra supplies that I might need at that moment in time. I don't know why they're going all the way up and over there. I think it would be faster to go out through here. Unless it's because it's like a choke point, because all the people that are shuffling resources to that. I mean, that could be why. Alright, so somebody's probably going to get injured here since we're still pending some resources.
He might sustain minor injury. Nope, he got inside just in time to not sustain an injury. But this guy, on the other hand, is my medic. He's actually sustained a pretty severe injury. Good thing I have... I actually don't think I have another medic, do I? My medic sustained injuries, but I need a medic to heal my medic. Ah, uh, yeah, see, that's, that's where the flaw in this whole system is going to come into play. There we go, now I can have 10 people sleep of the 16 that I have. Wow. Maybe I should go ahead and just build another one. Now I can have 12 of my 16 people sleep at any given time. That's not too bad. I have this water tower which holds 600 water at any time. So if I end up running out of water for some reason, I still have the water tower. Still below 60, which is good. Which means I'm just gonna sit on 22 and a half thousand kilowatts or whatever the hell it is. So I have two carrier bots and one constructor bot, one medic. I believe it is this person, is it not? Where's my medic? Did my medic- was my medic able to heal himself? He was! Okay, good. So medics don't need other medics to heal them. They can heal themselves. That is good to know. I wasn't sure if that was going to work out in my favor. So how are we? We're sitting on about 30 vegetables. It's okay. Get some more colonists in here. What kind of colonists do we have? It's gonna depend on what we should do. We got an engineer and we got a medic. Okay. Now we have four engineers and two medics. And it's about time for more workers and some guards. So all these, yeah, all these are being maintained fine. Okay, so we've run out of spares. So it is time to build a factory. The factory can go right here. It's connected to that. Cycle it, and I'll build a factory right here. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Then I can build a security room right here. And when I build up and down and over this way, these whole guys hopefully will be protected by the security room there. Later on, when I expand out this way, I can build like another security room like here. So that way, this whole area will be protected as well. 
I think that's what we're gonna end up doing. What kind of colonists we got this time? Worker and a worker. Cool. Now we have eight workers, six biologists, four engineers, two medics, zero guards. I still think two more workers is probably gonna be the best way to go. and see how that get how that does for us. So are we yeah we're still increasing the vegetables. We're doing okay on medical supplies at the moment. I think it wouldn't be a bad idea to get one more medicinal pad up. Potentially run a surplus. But I have two medicinal plant pads up, and then I can produce double the amount of medicinal plants. people. So I am going to want to start powering this. How's I going to put my water strain? Eh. I mean, I do have a 600 stockpile of water, but if that ends up going down, I'm going to have to build a second water thing. So I got another medicinal pad up. Yeah, that was pretty close. Fourteen people who can now sleep. I could really use another carrier bot.
So I really need biologists. Really need biologists. Pretty much need a guard. If I get a worker, an engineer, a medic, it's cool. Alright, I'm fine with that. These are all still running well. Yes, they are. I really need more bioplastics. It's weird, I've never been sure on bioplastics so far. But apparently right now, I, I, it's probably because I'm building so many of these. So many of these beds and all that other stuff. Just I'm using so many bioplastics at once right now. It's just I can't keep up with the demand. I know we're out of spares, which is not good, because some of these aren't at full capacity. Just a guard and a biologist. Okay, cool. So I finally got a guard. That means it's about time to build a control center. build another water extractor as well. That'd be fun. I don't even think the water extractor needs plastic, does it? No, it's just pure metal. Which I'm pretty sure I got the metal for, so that'll be a quick and easy build. Got an injured worker. Medics on it. What do we got? More colonists. What is that? A worker and another guard? Am I right? A medic and another guard. Okay. So three medics. Two guards. I think we'll reduce the guards down to 10%. go that'll be fine so I could really use more biologists more workers it's pretty important I can use more engineers who mans this engineer see this is just worker 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 so I could actually use more engineers than I thought I could do that. Apparently I'm fine on workers for right now. So I feel 
feel like I need to generate more power now as well. Now just slow it down. We're gonna go ahead and build a larger one of this. And build a redundancy into it. solar panel while we're at it. The constructor bot's broken. again and we got an engineer and an engineer okay cool so we got two more engineers now we have six engineers I'm gonna go ahead and say six engineers is probably fine here we go we'll do 40% biologist 20% worker I don't really need another medic What are we doing on supplies? Still a ton of vegetables. We're building up meat. We do have 29 people. About time. We built a few more beds. Can I squeeze one more in there? I can't. Okay, so build it right there. That's 16 people that can sleep in there at any given time. How's the morale? Pretty good. Anybody hungry, thirsty, anything like that? No, not really. Ooh, that was close. So I'm trying to think. This is a trade ship, actually, so let me see what you got on offer. I'd like to trade you some surplus and vegetables. I'd like to keep about 25 of it. But maybe you'll give me all your money. And a couple meals. That'd be fine. So now after this, I'll have like a hundred bucks towards spare stuff. Decent, excellent, 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 excellent. We're about stable on medical supplies. There's a medic who works that, and it's a biologist who works that. Power storage is critical? Is it really, or are you just telling me that? No, you're kind of right. Power storage. Oh god, power storage kind of is critical right now. Yeah, so we definitely need the other solar panel up. And after that, we need a second or a fourth power collector as well. Oh god, I hope we make it through the night. I don't think we're gonna make it through the night. I think it's gonna be a first power outage of the game right here. Oh god. Oh god, come on wind. Come on wind, pick up a little bit. I really need the wind to pick up and we are out of power. Ah, oh, that's awful. Right before sunbreak. I guess if we're gonna run out of power, it's like the perfect time to do it right before 
the sun starts to come up. Down there, build that solar panel. Build that power collector. We need to get our utilities set straight before we worry about anything else. We're making about double power right now. We just don't store enough during the night to actually last. Maybe I should stop taking colonists for just a little bit. We got two biologists. So what's our ratio now? Eleven workers, nine biologists, six engineers, three medics, and two guards. I'm gonna say more guards. More workers. I don't need any more biologists. console in there too at some point but I'm not really worried about it right now no, let's not even do the armor at the moment because I'd rather that metal go down here into this from you. Can kinda use some metal from you too. But I don't really need it. I mean ore I think might be a little more cost effective. Give you two medical supplies. A couple medicinal plants. Some vegetables and some vitro meat. And you would take that. I think it's gonna work. So I'm pretty sure I still have a surplus of vegetables and everything. Doesn't seem like I'm in any kind of a shortage for them. the second battery but wind has been strong tonight so I think it's gonna be okay I oh, only need one more metal and we can actually build that so I think this is gonna be fun I'm gonna go ahead and call this an episode here it's ran a little bit longer than what I would usually like to do just by a couple minutes nothing too bad but even still I would rather not run this too long. Um, Alright, so thank you guys for watching. I will catch you guys in the next video. Okay? Bye bye.